Hi, I'm Tara Lee Cobble of the Bible Recap Podcast and Book, and today you and I get to talk about the verse of the day, Isaiah 53, 5. Here's what it says. He was pierced for our transgressions. He was crushed for our iniquities. The punishment that brought us peace was on him, and by his wounds we are healed. So this verse is from a section of scripture referred to as the suffering servant. It's found in Isaiah 52 and 53, and it's filled with prophecies about Jesus. This verse paints a clear picture of Jesus as the Messiah. He was a man of sorrows, acquainted with grief. He was despised and rejected. So if you have ever felt any of those things, this verse reminds us that he gets it. He gets you. But when we feel pain, we don't just want to be understood. We want to be relieved. We want the grief and the pain to end. And because of what Jesus has accomplished for us and granted to us, we have access to the kind of eternal peace and relief that we don't get anywhere else except in relationship with him. And it's not just for here and now, it's for forever, which is incredible. But that peace that he's granted to us, it came at a high cost. It came at the cost of bloodshed, his death. Our sins are weighty and costly. They aren't frivolous things, they're devastating. And no one sins in a vacuum. My sins impact others, even the ones that only take place in my head. My thoughts and actions have consequences, and so do yours. They put us in sin debt, which is why this verse is such a comfort. He paid our sin debt with his righteousness, with his death on the cross. He paid it all. Because Jesus is God, he was able to live the perfect life to meet all the holy requirements. He acts as the perfect mediator between God and man between us and the Father. So today, if you feel the weight of your sin, don't run from God, run to him. He's the one who drew near, who leaned in. He is the place that you're gonna find peace and healing now and forever and nowhere else. He paid it all. Nothing can separate you from the Father's love. So don't miss it. Don't let your perfectionism or your pride or your shame keep you from him. Lean in. He's where the joy is.